Look guys, if you recognize this. It's still on the wall in Scotland. Good morning guys. I just realized I'm gonna show you. There is a lizard right out here on our front railing. You guys see that lizard right there? Have we said lately how much we love living in North Carolina? You get cool little guys like this one. Okay, I did not pick up the camera to show you that lizard, but it distracted me. We've had a busy morning. We packed up a bunch of orders from our online store of our new pop sockets and bracelets. Um, there, here's one. Here, it's a, and I dropped it on the floor. It's a take the next step little pendant bracelet. We took a bunch of them to the post office and then we were like, it's Friday, it's date day. Sometimes we have dates on Fridays. So we went out to lunch and had a nice sushi burrito, stopped at Walmart and got a refill on popsicles because Mary's been digging two different kinds of popsicles. One is grape popsicles and the other is banana popsicles. And it's hot out here. It, it is, really it is. Good morning, Harry. We gotta show them the special package we got from our friends in oh. Scotland. <laughs> okay, guys. Okay, so the family that we stayed with, they picked us up. Wait, yeah, they picked us up. They picked us up from the airport, and we they took us back to their house, and we slept because it was a long flight. We gotta grab him if we're gonna go inside. Okay, come on, Harry. What's going on? Get baby. Okay, so this yeah, we stayed with them for did we stay a few days? I think. Yeah, because like I think we didn't get into our flat for a couple days. Anyways, look guys, if you recognize this, this is not the one, but it is the one. So we left. Let's see, in Scotland, above our kitchen. It was, no, it was above the stove. Yep. Above the stove, which it was a miniature stove, like this big. Yep. We put some like command strips on the back and we put it up and then we hung that Ikea. That must have already been there. The mm. mug holder? We made that, yeah. We, we, that we did that. <laughs> I think we just put hooks on the wall. I think. I don't remember. I had like a bar. I don't know. Well. Either way, we hung mugs. It looks so cute. Here's our wee little kitchen. Streaky bacon, which is bacon as we know it in the States, but bacon here is like ham, and streaky bacon is true bacon. And when, since we had to move out in a hurry, Peter kind of just forgot about it. I wasn't there for that. Anyway, so it's still on the wall in Scotland. Yeah, of that flat that we rented, but our friend saw our vlog where just recently, I think a couple of months ago, we were talking about some of the things we accidentally left in Scotland because I kind of packed up in a, I think in that a was hurry. Like three weeks ago. Was it like three weeks ago? Okay, it wasn't too long ago. We had that little um, metal circle thing that tin was tray. Like tin tray that we put. We used it as art above our stove. And it was like, what did it say? Like, was it like made in the UK or something? Or it was like some sort of like UK? I think it was Sky Scotland. It was like the British flag or something. Something. And she saw that vlog and she searched and researched and found the, because this was the one thing we were like, oh, I wish I had brought that home. Because it was just a simple yet um, really meaningful decoration in our flat. Anyways, she also we, sent this pillow cover. We were so blessed by that. A little taste of Scotland. Yeah. Yeah, it's really meaningful that day we were with them. Our first day is there. I know. Yes. Well, I just had the most low blood sugar dinner ever. First, I was low. Well, 
first I didn't know I was, I don't know. My Dexcom said I was like 75 or something. So I was like, I'm gonna have a popsicle. While I was having the popsicle, I was like, something just doesn't feel right. And I was like finishing my popsicle and I test, finger tested and I was 58. So I was lower than that. Anyway, so basically the Dexcom didn't catch that. Uh, whatever. Then I was hungry as you do when you're low and I'd had the popsicle and then Peter was like how about some pimento cheese sounds good to me so I had pimento cheese and crackers and then I felt like having some cashews and at that point Peter's like so are we just eating snacks for dinner is that what's going on here so <laughs> sorry that's what happened blood sugar is totally fine now but I still feel a little like not great from it. <laughs> you might notice that I have some Sharpie on my arm right now. CF get loud, getting loud for my friends in Canada. You can go check my Instagram if you wanna read about that. But I realized that I wanted to be able to see the writing in the photo so I thought a Sharpie would be like the boldest thing to use and I thought I'll just Google like how to get Sharpie off your skin. But then I just realized I should have just used like straight black um, watercolor paint. That would have washed off easier than Sharpie, certainly. <laughs> oh well, <laughs> next time. Okay, interesting, look, so the flower, this was the flower of the prickly pear that is now rot, rotten, rotten? It rotted, it's finished. And now that is the fruit that will hopefully ripen. Let's see about this one. Ha ha! Cool. Do you wanna go give a garden update? Yeah, we need to put up, we got the stakes so we can put up some oh, good, supports yeah. for our tomato plants. So here is a tomato growing on our deck. <laughs> right there. And then our garden update. Oh, guys don't look happy. Well, yeah, I don't. It's breaking. Yeah, this one broke. Oh, sad day. So we gotta. We need like really tall. Oh, we could use those hooks. Or er, wait, do we, do we have more? We should eat those peas from the dead branch. Okay. Peas, hey look, it's us, Peter. Peas, two peas in a pod. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> mm. Okay, so these are the yellow beans here, the kale, the shelling peas, the purple green beans. Let's see if I can find one to show you. Right there. Oh, wow. Look at this tomato. Oh, oh this was good how you put that up there. Yep. I used that was it to support this tomato. Great. Like this one's going crazy. Breaking. Yeah. Um, this guy. We don't like those. Okay. The shells are like really hard to chew. Is that like, I don't know. Did they need to ripen more or something? I don't think so. Okay. I don't know. Oh, oh, Peter. Oh yeah, I forgot. Oh yeah, 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 I forgot. This is like a little green pepper, I think. And then, let's see. What else we have here? And oh yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. You see these, Peter? Oh my god. I know. So these with this shape leaf are rainbow tomatoes. So how's that going? Peas are good. Oh good. Okay, cool. And then this shape of leaf, these are heirloom tomatoes. 
Amazing. And then banana peppers, I would say these are probably ready, huh? Do you think? Um, I hope these are truly banana peppers and not too spicy. Yeah, I think, I'm pretty sure they are. You think they're ready? Oh, 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 I think they're banana peppers. I don't know how big they get. I don't know either. Oh wow, this is just crazy town. Look at that. Cucumbers, oh my goodness, Peter. What? Come here. Hey, I'm trying to figure out what to do with this thing so it doesn't break. <laughs> that is so crazy. Oh, haha. -ha. The cactus, okay. or whatever see. it's called. Look. Just like those leaves. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> I thought you were giving me a cucumber. Do you wanna pull a, um, pull a, a carrot? carrot? See the progress? I think these need to go for a bit longer. Honey. Wait, did you get the big one? Or, what uh, let's just look for a big one like this one. Oh, it's so cute. I feel like I should put him back in. No, he's perfect and cute just the way he is. <laughs> okay. So cute. Okay, should we pick the um, bell peppers, whatever these are? Banana peppers? Do you think they're full grown? I don't know. I feel like that's how big banana peppers get. Okay, we'll pick one. Well, that was the smallest one. But he looked like he had some markings. Yay, I'm so excited. Here, let's wash them off. Carrot? Banana oh. pepper. Okay. Ready? I'll, I'll eat this half first and you eat that half first and we'll okay. switch. All right, ready, set, go. Mm. Mm, salad. Mm, pepper. Mm. Spicy. Is it? Slightly. Delicious. Nutritious. And yum yum. Okay, here's the back garden. We got carrots growing, we got peas growing, we got onions and tomatoes, but we needed a support for these peas, so we got a couple of steaks, and this was leftover fencing from when we fenced in the side garden. And uh, yeah, so we tied up some of those peas so that they'll grow up along there and keep them off the air conditioner. So there's your garden update. Ollie's our garden guard dog. Aren't you a good garden guard dog? Ollie's eating his dinner. Mary and I, after we took a walk around the neighborhood and we've been sitting here just, I had a kombucha and we were just chilling on the couch watching a video and Mary goes, maybe we could go get an RB sandwich later. And then she goes, go look in the trash. And apparently we had gotten, oh, Arby's. We got flyers in the mail today. She's like, there's probably a coupon in the trash. One dollar. Oh, there goes the chicken. What do we got? I was talking too much. Okay, one dollar small chocolate or other small shake. Jamocha shake from Arby's. So One dollar curly fries. I just want my old sandwich. Okay, wait just a second. Wait just a second. What two roast beef sandwiches, two curly fries, two soft drinks, and mozzarella sticks for eight ninety nine. Who needs that much food? I guess if you have a family. I guess. It's <laughs> way too much food for the two of us. Okay. Beef and cheddar, yellow mellow. And fries. We don't need mellow yellow. How about the two for four? We can each get a roast beef sandwich. That'd be good. This is our Friday night, guys. The makings for a very fun date. Want to go on a date? Yes. You want to go? You want to go get a belly ache? Yes. <laughs> Actually, we just got in the car and we both said, actually, I'm not that hungry. I'm not hungry at all. Okay, so change of plans. I think what I'm in the mood for, because I'm not like hungry enough to eat an RB sandwich, I'll give you two guesses. Um, pepper and cream cheese? Yes. Peppers and cream cheese. I was really excited about that date, but we can still have a nice time just here at the house. <laughs> not eating fast food. Yeah. But I bet you this is this is going to be fast food. 
It's ready. That was pretty fast. You wanna go out? Okay, let's go find Peter. Follow the country music and you'll find my date. Yes. There's a picture of Peter taking a picture of Harry because Harry likes to go on top of his tent sometimes. I guess it's like a little hammock for him. Uh -huh. All right, y'all, it's been a good night and we're gonna wrap it up here. Mary's already up, getting ready for bed. I'm gonna end it and say, as always, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night, guys. I'll end on this flamingo since Ollie's up in bed already too.